This here is a Lenovo Legion glasses <laughs> set. I know what it does. Basically, it's going to give you virtual screen. So you put on the glasses and you're going to have a virtual screen in front of you. It's not like true VR where you put the headset on and you're in a VR environment. Uh, basically, what it's going to do is going to, you're going to project. You're going to see a screen in front of you. Uh, so you, I guess you can play games with the glasses on and kind of see what's going on. So let's open these bad boys up and put them on. We get a little booklet, which I might actually have to read because I probably don't know what I'm doing here. You get a nice little carrying case, very cute. This is probably the cableage. Okay, so we get rubber things. I don't know. Um, nose pads, probably. More nose pads, maybe if you're like a greasy boy. Uh, cleaner. Um, prescription lens template. Oh, I guess if you have, if you're near, if you're farsighted, you need nearsighted glasses uh, or farsighted. I'm not sure how this will work. You can take these into your doctor. You can take these into your optometrist and say, I need glasses. Very cool. Carrying thing there. Very cool. By the way, I get motion sick with VR. So I hope this isn't the same. Some protection on the glasses there. We got nice thick uh, lens there, which I guess helps it project out. Very cool. I don't actually know how this tech works that well. Uh, yeah, on here we have some type of controls, two controls, a hinges feel good, and pretty sturdy. Looks like there's some metal in there. Not sure if that's, yeah, it looks like actual metal potentially. Yeah, it's actually like real metal, not just plastic painted. Uh, rubber tip here for comfort, looks good. And the connectors, these have to be wired, right? So we have uh, on the right side here, one and two. So brightness up, brightness down, three and four, volume up, volume down. Do they have speakers in them? Oh, uh, these little things here I think are speakers, which will sit on your ears. Volume up, volume down, blue light mode, and display off. So those are volume and brightness. The biggest issue, the biggest issue, is that there's no way you can have as much swag as me with these stunner shades on right now. Incredible. Incredible drip. Look at that. Just, I'm just gonna wear these, just out and about, with the wire too, just don just hanging down, and people are gonna be like, what is this guy doing? Who is he, and why is he so cool? And I'll be like, it's Legion, bro. It's Legion. Incredible drip. Incredible drip. So, uh, they actually feel pretty comfortable. Um, yeah, they're very comfortable, to be honest. Not really touching my forehead. Maybe they are, but I can't really feel them. Nose pads feel really comfortable, actually. On the ears feel comfortable. Uh, I do wear glasses sometimes. They're pretty, like, minor. I don't really have too much of any of them, so I'm used to wearing glasses. Uh, but realistically, these are way more comfortable than my actual, uh, like, sunglasses or glasses. They're quite comfortable. Uh, they're not too heavy either. Like, they feel nice on the ear. Not really irritating me over here. Nice padage over there. So I'm pretty happy with the fit and conformity to my head. This is basically what I'm seeing here. So for me, uh, this is there's a little bit of distortion here, just the tiniest little bit on the outside here where that is. The center is nice and clear, right? Very, very crisp. Let me move that mouse in there. Yeah, that looks pretty good. There's a little bit of distortion over here for sure, a little bit. Uh, could just be the lens shape there. Let me move something over here to the right side. Put it down here. Uh, like that's a little bit harder to read there and then it's better in the center. So let's fire up some games here before I puke and uh, we'll do a little bit of gaming. Right now, if you look at me, um, I see the screen in front of me. I don't know how far it would, like perceptively, it's hard to describe how far I would say. It looks close, but it's also kind of far. Maybe like a foot in front of my face, two feet. Almost looks like it's, yeah, it looks about the same distance as my monitor over here, uh, which is a couple feet away from me. So that's about how far it perceptively looks. It's obviously not. The lenses are directly in front of my face, but it looks like it's a little bit farther in front of me here. Okay, so we got a dual screen setup. You guys are seeing what I'm seeing here. And uh, I mean, they work. I, I see a monitor right in front of me. If you move your head, it's going to be a little weird because you're going to, it's going to move with you, which is just strange. Uh, but the audio is here. Let's chest these buttons here. That's the speakers here coming right into my ear. It's 
pretty clear. Let's check the brightness here. Oh wow, they get really bright actually. All right, so I need to keep my head static or I'm gonna projectile vomit. By the way, I'm very sensitive to motion sickness. Just so you know. Uh, that was controllers being weird, but. I mean, it's pretty freaking cool. What's my frame rate at here? Yeah, I should probably turn the settings. I'm gonna change the settings here slightly. You know, I don't think I would get motion sick using this unless I move my head a lot. Because that's gonna make me sick because the screen is moving. But if I were to, for example, not sit in the chair, maybe sit, like, lay on a bed or something or sit on a couch and keep my head relatively static. Oh man, this is pretty cool, actually. This is pretty freaking cool. Imagine this with a Lenovo Legion Go. Like, you sit on your desk, you sit in your bed, you sit on your couch, wherever you have your Legion Go, which is just a relatively small screen in front of you, right? Something like that, which is fine, but you don't want to hold that up in front of you. You can just have your Legion Go off to the side or as a, you know, basically as a controller, and you plug this in because Legion Go has two uh, USB ports, and you're going to have a monitor in front of you. This is, the, the actual color clarity is quite nice. Let me just quickly take these off like that. Look at my OLED screen, OLED Lenovo Legion. Yeah, it looks pretty darn good. I wish I could show you, but other than the fact that that's an OLED screen and these are not, it's like a projection basically, it's pretty freaking good, honestly. Yeah, she feels, she's moving nice and fluid there. Uh, no latency at all. I'm actually not getting motion sick, to be honest. I'm actually not getting motion sick at all. Uh, it was just because I was moving my head too much. But once you keep your head relatively static, uh, you'll be fine. And I'm I'm very prone to motion sickness. Very, very prone to motion sickness. Uh, so the average person probably would just not even notice. Uh, someone like me who's very prone to motion sickness, just don't freaking move your head around a lot like that because you're going to get sick. Um, this looks pretty good. Um, so yeah, the audio is good. It's nice and clear right into the ear. Sounds good. It's not too loud. Nice and clear. Uh, the screen or whatever you want to call them inside gets nice and bright. Uh, the color is very good. The greens are very vivid. I'm just kind of peeking under if you like and compare to that. Very, very clear. Uh, the resolution looks pretty crisp actually on this here. Um, yeah, I don't have any problems with it whatsoever. Looks pretty good, honestly. Maybe you just have like, you know, a Legion Go or something like that, like a small handheld or a laptop like this here, you know, you can put this on and you have access to a big screen. So I'm pretty happy with these actually. So yeah, these are pretty freaking cool. Um, I mean, it's hard to review because you're not going to see what I'm seeing here. Uh, but realistically, I'm going to tell you guys right here that the uh, audio is good. To be honest, it sounds quite good. The speakers are going right into the ear. Very nice. The image quality is actually very good. The color space is good too. Uh, it's not really much of a difference, honestly, coming from an OLED screen, which is shocking. So this has got to be emulating like a you know, DCI-P color space, basically something like that. They look very good. At least 100% sRGB is what I'm seeing. It's hard to describe because it's like in a little screen there. They're very, very comfortable. I could wear these for hours without any issues whatsoever. Um, yeah, and you can hear the audio coming out of them, out of the speakers there. Uh, so I'm pretty happy with these. I mean, for the price, what you're getting here, these are pretty compelling, actually. I think these are a really good product. Uh, they're actually very approachable in terms of pricing. Um, you know, you get lots of sales on product like this from Lenovo. You can get into these for a pretty compelling price here. They are nice and comfortable. The image quality is very clear and crisp. And um, yeah, I mean, it's just nice because you can have yourself like a little handheld. I don't have mine around me, but you could have your Legion Go plug these in. You don't have to hold, have a whole setup, right? Just take this, that with you. Hook it into your laptop. You don't have a monitor. If you have a dormitory, your student, I mean, on your break at work, you know, you're just hanging out in your lunchroom or whatever, throw on these glasses. You don't have to have a full freaking setup, something like that. These are pretty cool. So I'm going to say these are actually really, these are a really cool product. I wasn't so sure about them and I was really worried about getting motion sick. Um, I didn't get motion sick once I stopped moving my head around constantly. Um, and I think for the price, what you're getting into here is very good because the quality is good. They work exactly as they're intending to work. I didn't notice any latency whatsoever. So these are going to get actually a pretty decent recommend from me. I picked these up off the Lenovo Direct website. I'll put some links in the video description down below if I can find them to different Lenovo stores. I do have some affiliate links through Impact, not through Lenovo directly, but through Impact. Uh, and that does help me out because the vast, vast majority of products I buy, like I'm talking uh, you know, laptops, this kind of stuff, I buy probably 95% of the laptops that I review and it gets expensive, unfortunately. Um, so it does help me out if you guys just use those affiliate links. It doesn't add any cost to the product whatsoever. Uh, it just helps me get a little bit um, of, uh, 
help uh, for my channel. But um, yeah, I don't think these are necessarily going to be for everyone. If you have like really bad vision, you might have an issue. You're going to have to get those lenses, which might be a bit of a pain in the butt. Um, but someone like me with, you know, like a pretty mild prescription, like 125, 150, something like that. I mean, I had no issues. I could see all the text in the settings, no problems whatsoever. Um, I think these are a really good product overall. So it's really the same as, you know, taking your laptop and hooking up to an external monitor, except you can just lay down in your bed and the monitor is in front of you. So very cool product here.